you could get that carried away. You remind me of my brother Danny. Oh, he, had a, he had a big mouth too. Oh, oh fuck. Don, here we go. go. I'm, just, I'm just saying. Here we go with the mid. Here, play with the mid. Let's see your jab. Yeah. yeah. It's just gonna get madder and madder. How much rage is in you? There you go. Bring your stuff back high. Bring it back high. Because you're, you're coming back low. I'm dipping down. Yeah. Okay, walk around and shake it off. Breathe deep. Okay, come on with that jab cross. So why would you come on a HBO show like that? I remember you saying the guy was on the show who played the piano with his ass. I only remember little moments. I was scared. You were scared? Yeah. You know? Because when someone's on a comedy show that's centered around one person, and I'm saying this truthfully, when someone's <coughs> on a comedy show that's centered around one guy, they were all spinning around you, you're in every frame, basically, and you are, you know, fucking eighth degree black belt funny. So you come on and go, I can't have any ego. I can't have what? I can't have any ego. I can't have any ego! Well, I didn't have any ego. No, see, I can't. Yeah? You come on, and you're there to be, you know. Yeah, but yet you bring Played your... with. And have fun. Yeah, you brought your power, though. That well, that, no, the, the power that I brought was implied because I was boning your wife before the show. Ah. Uh. You know. But on the show, it was all you. You have the power. Hey, oh, good, good. Boom. That's like, uh, what were we watching, Foreman Lyle? Yeah. You know that Foreman Lyle fight where they just keep hitting each other and they're standing there? That's they're swinging that, his arms. <laughs> that's what you were doing. I you know. were not moving your feet and you just had the power? Yeah. That was good. He's anchored. Here, put your foot up there. Well, see, uh, you got to help me. I don't understand uh, how come he's anchored, but if I stand somewhat flat, you say I'm not moving my feet. You are two different people. You got two different things going on. You can't fight. What do I have, fear in my feet? <laughs> no. You can't fight what? Everybody fights <coughs> differently according to their disposition. Why would you want to stand and slug it out with somebody? It's just not, it's not who you are. So you want to keep me more or less moved, more on my sure. balls and my feet, right? Fight, yeah, fight what, what, what works for you, you know? He can stand there. And, he, and eventually what I would do is I would introduce uh, both to both of you guys. He's got to dance and you've got to stand in there. You know, so that you're comfortable in all places in the ring. Because you know what somebody, the guy that trained me, he said, you know what your biggest problem is? He goes, because you're nervous, because you're afraid of the outcome, regardless of the size of the opponent, you're trying to get it over too quickly because you're nervous. Oh, that's where his fear You're trying out. to predict the outcome. Mm -hmm. You want to nail this guy, you're trying to knock him out. Right. You're trying to hurt him. Mm -hmm. You're trying to get him to give. In the back of your mind, you're waiting for somebody to come in and declare a foul and throw you out. There's, there's an unconscious part of you that you, tr you want it to end. Because right. you can't do that. So really, you're standing and throwing with power is a... Uh, uh, it's your way of taking control. It's a fear. It's, it's, a, it's a an fear attempt mechanism. to pay the check and go to the valley park and get out of here. <laughs> it's my... It's the way I, so I like saying check, please. I remember, like I said, the thing that... Was so he has most? fear. <laughs> yeah. See, that's what I, I think. Now that so I've seen you throw the right hand, what, are you kidding me? All right. Any given day. That was not un unnecessary. Yeah. That was true. Yeah. You got a good right hand. I wouldn't lie to you. I, I, I totally keep, was prepared to come in here both ways. I was going to come in here and go, okay, it's a comedy thing, and you're going to do something. And then I realized, you know, you got a good right hand. Am I lying? No, he's right. You got a good right hand. Your left hand needs a little work, but your right hand is strong. <laughs> so do you think that fear is what drives you sometimes, and I'm not kidding, in a scene because you bring a lot of power to a scene? Do you also go into a scene and go, I'm going to win this and... Uh, yes. Be yes. I'll be damned. I go into the scene and I say, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to kick your fucking ass. See? So that's what that's your That's what the scene is. requires. That's what your essence is. <clears throat> and I'm mine, gonna is win. More, mine is more dancing I'm going to win. We're going we're gonna to get down to it now or we're right. going to get down to it later. We're going to get down to it on page one. We're going to get down to it on page five.
but I am going to win. And I just go in there and... Is there, there's vulnerability in that, though, isn't there? Well, it all sounds like vulnerability. Right. Yeah. yeah. And what was your experience then when you came in to do that episode, not knowing what you'd be walking into? I was scared to death of you. And what happened? What was the, what was the sense you of You smacked it? me around a little bit, you know. Well, that's when you... But that's what you do. You took my parking spot. Yeah. You know, that handicap spot's for me, buddy. The cold sore spot. What did it feel like? What was the difference? What's the difference between that and going well, into work on Will and Grace? Here's the, here's the difference. The people who are really, really funny people, <clears throat> like boxing, like people who are conditioned, and I'm not saying this to be convenient, that part of them is very well conditioned. So when you walk in, you think of all, I'll think of things that are relatively funny in the rearview mirror on the way home, you know? Whereas when you go do the show, when you're around guys like him, when you're around uh, Sean Hayes, when you're around people, Megan Mullally, when you're around, you know, Ray Romano, whoever the person who is the Zen master comedy person, you're around those people and they just sit there and go, you know, <laughs> you know, they just got it all the time. Whereas when you come, so when you come on the show, you're like, am I ever going to possibly be funny enough to be on the show? And then what did it feel like once you started the The writers scene? do the smart thing where they write it where you don't have to be the funny thing on the show. Okay, what did it feel like then when you started to do a scene? Did you feel like that was going on or not? I could tell you were one of those comedy cannibals that was going to rip my head off and cook it and eat it right there if you wanted to. Well, I, see, I don't think that's true, but that is what I feel with you when you're in the ring, you see? Isn't that funny? Yep, that's what I feel. So now you have a little bit of a taste but see, I never of how I felt back in 1992. But see, I would How do you like it? I would... Come on. I'm sorry, Karen. we decided to do Too much this. talk. You know, Dave, I say full contact in a second. I don't care if I die. <laughs> but I would never grab you and hold you against the ring like that. Did I ever do it at the show? Yeah, that's great. Dave, can we carry on? Uh -huh. I think that answers it. Because I respect you and I uh, want to make you comfortable. This is how I respect you. By this grabbing me and, and uh, knocking what little life there is left out. I was going to get a workout in. <laughs> you go with that? I got to go. Okay. So dance with me one more time. Come on, just dance. Come Take it out. See you in your court. <laughs> Breathe in through your nose. That was good. Good stuff. You have fun, huh? It is fun. I haven't done that in a long time. So I'd like to keep in contact with you. <laughs> <laughs>